Hello, everybody! Good Buddy Q here with something very different, but very close to my heart. This is something called Interactive Laugh... Interactive Math Journey, excuse me. Um, my dad was super into two things. One, giving us kids an education. Two, video games. So, when in the 90s and early 2000s, that was a big thing, he was like, hell yeah, get these kids some edutainment games. Especially with me, Little Miss Autistic, who didn't do, like, who didn't do, like, uh, the learning so good. So, this, of all the edutainment games, this one was my favorite. And I found a ROM of it. Like, I still have the actual CD, but it doesn't fucking play on a computer. But I found it on a DOS ROM, a DOS emulator website. And I'm like, you fucking bet I'm gonna fucking play it. So I just wanted to share some of my childhood with you. And you may have been hearing me use the phrase, you did it, turn the page, in a lot of LPs recently. This is where it's from. This is something that remains in my vocabulary to this day. That's how much of an impact this game was for me. I still had Echolalia attached deeply into it. And then, even though I haven't played it in fucking forever, so we're gonna play it now. We're gonna learn math. Let's go. Hell fucking yes! One, two, three. Okay, it's a little glitchy. Just, uh, deal with that? Ah, oh, yes. Tally Cat, yes. she is a lot like you. She She's is. wondering about what map can do. Come on along. Also, fun fact about main dude who sings Come on along. slash does the voice of the main guy for this voiced rat king in Care Bear. I'm sorry, I'm just, I'm, I'm so in love at this moment. Okay, I'll also explain why this has a deep meaning. This is Tally Cat. Tally, like, you know, number. And also Alley Cat. Hold on. Hey, aren't you gonna chase me? Nah. Nah, <laughs> I'm too busy counting. Aw, but what fun is that? What fun is that? Christ! Let me tell you all of the things that numbers can do. All right, Bugman. Who are you? I'm Pop the Math Explorer. So you're... And I'll lead you <laughs> on a journey to discover number power in a math dude, dude, world all right. full of learning. You'll learn <laughs> okay. fractions, measurement, multiplication, and addition. Hell you'll yeah. journey through ten math lands, and you'll yeah. meet the math magician. Ooh. Wow, let's go! I want to find the math magician! This bug showed up! How do we get there? And promise me magic! Here's let's go! Math. Now follow me. Yeet. And click on me whenever you want to see your journey options. You got it. All right. Let's go. Let's go. I'll come too. I can help. So I booted up a uh, account to make sure that it worked. Because, you know, didn't want to you know, think so. We're just going to make a new one. Uh, let's just go, uh, so, okay, the reason why I'm also attached to Tally is because my name, my OG name, can be twisted into the nickname of Alley Cat. That's something my parents call me. And so if Tally Cat, Alley Cat, I'm like, it's me, it's me, guys. And I was like, oh, I so, I so, uh, so, yeah. K, Y, O. Let's make sure we know this is <laughs> this is me. Uh, Kyokun. There we go. Let go. We'll start on the math journey spiral, and explore while we click, look, and listen. As we follow the path, we'll use more and more math. 
and discover the math magician. If you don't like rhyming, click on the flashing star puns, to continue your journey. You're not going to like this game very much, but if you like colorful and learning math, we're off. Let's go to the land of patchwork patterns. Also the mouse from Reading Rabbit. I loved the mouse. Loved that mouse so much. So when she was in this game, I was like, hell yeah. Why? It's a colonial community. Quite quaint, really. This is phonics. And quiet, too. Something tells me that's about to change. This ain't phonics. Give me math. Hate math, but I used to love math, actually. Whoa, you good? <laughs> nah. <laughs> um, this stuff like this made me love math until I was very bad at it in high school. Can you help this quilting bee? To cut her cards in two? Sure. She's having a party for Clara Quail, whose baby chicks are due. Oh, is that who he poked? To turn the page and hear my story, click on the page turn arrow. You fucking bet. Click on two hives to draw a line across each invitation. Your line should make two matching halves. A symmetrical creation. I also have so much fucking ringing rabbit from my dad's entertainment things. It'd be a thing. It'd be it'd be a fun thing. Uh, there was no Costco in our town. Like one, the closest one was like an hour and a half drive away. So we'd go to Costco and get so much food. And then also there was this giant stack of like video games. Sarah Spider has eight legs and two wide open eyes. Draw a line diagonally and create two matching sides. And so usually it was the Rita Rabbit stuff because it's like yeah, entertainment. So I have so much. Limp. Who sends a card like that? I don't know. This card is for someone who knows her shapes quite well. Will want her at the party. Who is it? Can you tell? I've only just met you, but it's me! Let's go. The party day is finally here. There's Cat. Our bee is so excited. All the friends she sees down the road are the ones she had invited. Hooray! Oh, there it is. <laughs> cool. So that's part one. Uh, the first five. Worlds have a story, an activity, and then a catchy song. So let's go to the activity. Yay. I'm so glad you decided to come to the quilting bee. This bee? is the line of symmetry. Sure is. It divides the pattern into two equal parts. Cool. Is that math? I guess. Geometry. Pick a fabric shape. Uh huh. And drag it to the gray part of the quilt design. Place it so it matches with the other side. Okay. That's it. Cool. Oh, need a drag and drop. Right, ribbit. They don't tell you this, but you press got... the space bar if you need to turn the shape. No. Oh. Actually, they do Yippee. tell you. Lol. Anyway, um, yeah, so Yippee. it was a very special occasion to get computer entertainment games. Of course, my dad was also the kind Yippee. where he would, um, when summer hit, he'd get us giant books Yippee. of, like, the next grade ups, like, study material right. for us to do over the summer. Did we ever do it? <laughs> no. But he always wanted us to. But man, wait, I don't think that's, I don't think that's right. Is it here? Yeah, I got it right, okay. Uh, here? Yippee! Cool. Um, that was neat. Boy. 
No, not that one. This one. Like that. Right. Ribbit. Cool. Something else I found on this DOS site of I think I want to try to play at some Yippee. point. Oh, wait, hold on. The design is symmetrical. Time to get wacky. You fucking go, dude. Also, behold, all three people here are the three from the story. There's the frog and the spider. Meow. Woo sauce, woo sauce. That looks great. Good job. Thank you. The baby quails with the blankets show how many quilts you've completed. Complete five, five quilt designs to collect an activity star. Yay! Click on your baby quail with the blanket to make your next quilt design. Yeah, okay. Anyway, what was Triangle. I saying? Triangle. Did I ask? Yippee! Square. Did I ask? Yippee! B. Right. Ribbit. Anyway. Um, this DOS site has a lot of cool things. It's called Classic Reupload. I recommend looking at it for it's, it's like really Yippee. old stuff. And I'm like, hey, I recognize a lot of these edutainment stuff here. It doesn't have a lot of the ones that I used to have once upon a time, but it has Triangle. a lot of. Did I ask, Tally? Um, but it's cool. And including the B. Did I ask? <laughs> they just want to know, man. Yippee! Um, Triangle. I swear to God. Yippee! No. Yes. Ooh, here. And then... Uh, Triangle. You? Yeah. Yippee! I found the first video game I ever played, like ever, in my life. Yippee! That I might do a let's the play for for is symmetrical. something. Maybe my birthday. Oh, let's go! It's starting to get wacky. This is what I learned what quilting was. Pretty. Perfect. Coo. Next. Oh, God. Uh, Rectangle. I did I ask. Try again. What? Is it Rectangle. This? Oh. Then what the fuck is this? These. Sorry. Oh, my God. Right. Anyway. First video game I ever played. Next up, Mother Goose. My dad loved Rectangle. being part of the big, Square. blossoming video game scene. Like, tech. He Triangle. loved being part of the scene. Like, he had a... Really? Uh... Where? Didn't line up with anything. Where'd it go? Right. Oh. Ribbit. Right there. Oh, it's the same fucking color. Lol. Anyway. My dad was real part of the Yippee. scene. Like, he had the SNES when it came out. Like, the one that played Super Mario 3 and Duck Hunt. Square. Like, he got the... He got the, um... He got the gun attachment Yippee! for right. Duck Hunt. So that was fun to play with. He also got a Game Yippee! Genie so we tiny little itty bitty kids could play with it too. <laughs> Which was really fun playing Super Mario 3 when you had infinite moon jump. And could get warp flutes like instantly. Purdy. Like little flowers. That looks great. Good job. Come here. 
Oh, God. Okay. We're gonna be in for it now, fellas. Triangle. Polygon. Poly- what? Okay. Yippee! Oh, Jesus. This is gonna be so many squares. Oh, God. That's so many squares. Triangle. Did I ask B? Worm. Triangle. What is this teeny tiny triangle for? Triangle. Is it here? Right there? Yippee! I fucking guess. So yeah. Yippee! We little itty bitty... <laughs> we itty bitty game babies could play game. Because of him. Square. Oh, it's a fish! <laughs> Lol. And he was actually the one that kind of got me into the gaming scene. I love my dad. He's he he's a funny guy. He had to work really far away from us because that's just how it was. Like he worked right. in construction Ribbit. and like road paving. So respect the road pavers, dude. They do a lot of hard work. Like he, yeah, he was the one who, like, got me into, like, computers, into, like, learning how to fix computers, le into video games, how to take care of, you know, tech and stuff. Right. Ribbit. Ribbit. Let's see. Da da da. I know this is me Yippee. talking about my past a lot, but hey, do I really get a chance to talk about that very much? Not very much, and hey, we're just making a nice quilt together, y'all. Why not have some- Right. I mean, this is what a stitching bitch is, right? You just go around, you stitch together Yippee. some pretty patterns, and you talk about life and things you're thinking about. Some hot gossip or tea. Anyway, right. Mix right. up Mother Goose. He Ribbit. has a- stack of floppy disks from the when that came out. Is symmetrical. Jazz Jackrabbit 2. 1 and 2. Oh god, how is this gonna be a fucking pattern? Okay. Less fish, more bulbs? Okay. That works, I guess. It's pretty. Sure is. Nice work. Cool. Oh god. Okay. This one doesn't look too too bad, I guess. Rectangle. Did I ask? Rectangle. Whoa. This one's gonna be fancy or burning your eyes. There's no in between. Right. Ribbit. Eh. Right. Ribbit. But. Triangle. Yeah. Right. Ribbit. Like, man, yeah, he was on the floppy disk craze. And he still has them of Mixed Up Mother Goose. And, like, I was so small, but he was like, hey, try to play it. And then I did. And that was the first game I ever played, and I was addicted to that bitch. I wanted more. Right. Ribbit. Parallelogram. Like, my dad one time, Yippee. when I was over in my adult age, like, he found the box, and he's like, oh my god, you Yippee. need to play this, remember this game? I'm like, oh yeah, I remember this game. And then we just kind of sat together and played it. Because, and this wasn't like the redo Try one. again. Oh, whoops. This wasn't like the fancier one from like later on either. This was the 8-bit stuff. The very slow, only honk. Yippee! Little pixel things. Everything looked terrifying because it was only 8 bit. Right. Ribbit. Square. Yippee! And then when I did graduate to other games like Jazz Jack Rabbit, when it came to Yippee! bosses, I got so scared of them, I would hide under the chair Triangle. and ask Dag to come over and fix it. Or, like, you know, beat the boss. And, like, the. In Super Mario 3, 
we I too got scared at the battleship parts because they were way too hard. And the Koopas were so scary. So he'd he'd beat he'd beat the Koopas and then he'd make funny noises when we fell out of the sky right. with the wand Ribbit. and he'd just make it such a funny time. The design is symmetrical. I love my dad. Cause honestly, without dad, he wouldn't. I wouldn't have gotten into gaming most likely. He also taught me my like audio equipment. He showed me what voice recorders were. He like showed me what microphones were, and like how to like put stuff together and edit my voice. That looks great. Good job. You're the brightest. Hooray! Get the fuck out Click of here. Alright, math song. Let's ride. What do we got? Oh. Oh, are we interrupting something, Miss B? Um. You and I, my mirror image. Yes. We live side by side. Uh huh. Yeah. A perfect reflection creates symmetry. Sweats. You can make a pattern out of triangles and squares. Yes. When both your sides are matching, that's symmetrical pairs. I, I guess. And on balance we create symmetry. I, I sure guess. By evenly. Interesting choice of a rock ballad about. That's it. That's all you get. Noise. There's our souvenir! Hooray! That math souvenir may help us find the math magician. Hooray! <gasps> they hatched! Crunch. All right, let's take this and be on our way. Ooh. A sugar cane field? Will we find the math magician here? Nah. Well, poke around a bit and see what you find. Okay, but I sure hope it all adds up to something. Ha 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 ha. It will if you take something away with you when you go. Stop it. Hey, what's what's up, my man? Ah, I've got just the right number of sugar canes. You do? Cool. Hey, Simone, want some more? Uh-oh. Here you go. Thanks. Thanks a lot, bruh. Get out of here. I think I'll leave that for next time. I'm gonna try to do a world per uh, episode, or at least until later on when it gets a little more fast paced. So yeah, that's gonna be for me. Uh, I hope you like this journey into math and little me's past. You can click on me if you want to go back to the map or click on a pop spot to go to an activity. Nah. <laughs> So yeah, we're on number two. So that's gonna be it for me. So have a good day, everybody. Bye. Meow.